We are stuck with this warm, humid, unstable air mass, and that's going to bring us some patchy morning fog and some more of those afternoon scattered showers. All the while, that humidity, the icky, sticky factor, going to be super high. Radar picture doesn't have a lot of energy this morning and have a lot of activity. Most of that fizzled out by 8, 9 o'clock last night, and I think the same thing will happen again today by 8, 9 o'clock tonight. Whatever showers do flare up, they're going to fizzle back out. Got some fog in Thomasville. We're at 72. We're at 72 in Valdosta and very humid. Tallahassee hanging on to 75. A little breeze trying to make it a little more tolerable outside, but still icky sticky out there. Nothing in the rain bucket at the airport yesterday. I've seen some reports as much as a half or three quarters of an inch of rain. So again, it all depends on where you are. 91 was that daytime high. Probably going to be someplace close to it again today. We are still stuck on the 92 and the 74. Nice to see a 73 at Bainbridge or a 72 at Camilla. Monticello this morning at 71. Look at those visibilities. Thomasville just down to one half mile. So yeah, the fog is out there. The vermin are lurking. Be careful. No organized energy across the southeast anymore. That boundary to our north is surging more north. And I think for the next several days, we're just going to be bottled up in this same air mass. Lots of warm, lots of humid, and plenty of those scattered summer showers, the ones that usually hit middle or late part of the afternoon, last 15, 30 minutes, and then done. And that's what we'll find on the future cast, more of the same. So almost identical to the previous three or four days, what I expect for the next three or four days. Maybe we'll thin out some of those shower chances just a little bit by the weekend. That's Franklin, as it was a hurricane making progress and landfall in Mexico, now a tropical storm and weakening. We're watching this area of disturbed weather here near the Bahamas. And this one out here is the same one we watched come off the coast of Africa last week. Both have a little potential for development, but neither one doing anything just yet. All right, on the Gulf today, winds start east turn on shore 5 to 15 and seas 1 to 3 feet. We are doing the high tides now. They'll wrap it up just before 7 a.m. 70s become 80s quick today, become 90s in many spots. It will be very muggy. From start to finish, we'll put the rain chance at 50-50 and call it so humid. Mid-70s for us tonight and staying muggy once the showers fizzle out. What about that extended forecast? Well, we're still stuck on the 92 and 74. Unsettled into the weekend at least. Maybe by the middle of next week, we can bring a boundary to the southeast. That might be something fun.